Hello and welcome to a bonus edition of Cracking the Cryptic. I fancied having a go at a cryptic crossword and somebody has recommended this puzzle uh, from last week from The Independent uh, here in the UK by Maze. Now, Maze is a name I know from cryptic crosswords because uh, Maze, I don't know if it's a man or a woman, but um, they created one of the most extraordinary grids I have ever seen, ever. I mean, it had it was a quintuple pangram, if I remember rightly. So into one of these uh, sort of not sort of bar or sort of blocked crosswords, I should say, they they somehow created a pattern that include every letter of the alphabet five times. Now, when I mentioned this to Mark, Mark was in absolute disbelief. Um, we have seen sort of double pangrams before, but uh, Mark didn't think a triple pangram would be possible. So to get five of each letter in is quite remarkable. So anyway, that's enough about Maze. Maze is clearly an extremely clever person. Um, let's have a look at how we'd solve this puzzle. So I'm just going to go through it and um, yeah, I'll talk you through my thoughts, which may or may not be helpful. Let's see. Cross punched into a heel designed to let air out. OK. OK, well, I can do this one. Cross is making me think of the letter X and that's punched into. It's inserted into a heel designed. That's telling us to anagram the letters of a heel. And the whole thing will then mean to let air out, and that's therefore exhale. Will it let me type it in? It will. Exhale. That gives me an X in one down. Lack of shelter as the river pours turbulently inside. Well, the river is probably the river X, which comes up a lot in crosswords. EXE. -E. Lack of exposure is going to be the answer, isn't it? So let's have a, let's put that in. So you can see it's an anagram of pours. Pause turbulently. Turbulently is saying anagram the letters of pause, put it inside uh, the, the river X, and then we get lack of lack of shelter, which of course is exposure. Unknown player first produced by Ramsey. Unknown player. Unknown is normally X, Y, or Z. Player first produced by Ramsey. Uh, not sure. A region of Welsh County. Ooh, that could be Wessex. Welsh can be W, and a county is Essex. And Wessex is a region, or used to be a region of England, so I think we'll go with Wessex. Everything in Thomas Hardy novels came from Wessex. Um, Ex monk moved to take in us long haired creatures. X monk. Okay, well, it's an anagram of X monk. Is it musk oxen? Is that a thing? A musk oxen? Um, so I've got that entirely from the wordplay, obviously, and the fact that there was an X in the grid. So if we anagram X monk, because we're moving it, and it just takes in the word us, we can create musk oxen, which might be long haired creatures. I have no clue. Uh, they fight. That might be kickboxers. Yes, it is. It's kickers for footballers around box, which is the euphemistic way of describing the penalty area in football. Uh, so this must be merc or something like that. one who's paid in military. Yeah, that's going to be a mercenary or a merc. Emergency requiring cool heads. Oh, uh, it's just the head letters of military emergency requiring and cool and somebody who's paid is a mercenary or a merc. Uh, so let's put that in and have a look at the one with a B in it. For example, British beef is a source of protein, e.g. British beef. Hmm. British beef. Is that something box maybe british beef might be b for british and ox for beef that would put oh is this that could be an x in this one as well an amount of poison directed at team guardiola's team well that must be a reference to pep guardiola it's another football reference an amount of poison directed at team No, so Man City would be Guardiola's team, or Bayern Munich, or 
Barcelona. Hmm. Allow a oh, former partner, that could be X as well. EX, your X is your former partner. Allow former partner to engage in offensive old way of spreading news. Hmm. That feels like it's probably got let and X in the middle of a word for offensive. Oh, I'm not seeing that one. Don't know. Line of little dots on the radio. A line. Uh, I should be able to get that. I'm not seeing it. Large plane happy to circle Californian airport. Um, no, I'm not getting that one either. This is going badly now. Living together, cohabitation uh, with six in company with 16 extraordinarily tense. Now, that must be extraordinarily te oh, tense must be an anagram of tense at the end of this living together company must be co 16 xvi what else could 16 be it could refer to the to merc i guess living together Co, see cohabiting would fit, but I don't understand how that would relate to the clue, and it would say Essex was wrong. Don't know. Title and last word back to front. Oh, well, that's name, because the last word in the Bible or a prayer would be Amen, and if we put the final letter of Amen to back to the front, we get name, which is a title. Love splitting tree with axes or axis in fury. Love probably is zero or O. Splitting a tree, that could be an ash tree with a hmm. axes or axes. This could be one of the names of the old Furies. What were the names of the Furies in Greek mythology? I can never remember them. I have to get that from the wordplay. Learn scripts in appropriate surroundings. Mm, no. Robotic voice describing new Nadir for African city. Robotic voice. <laughs> I don't know what that's referring to. Play regularly after times in goal increase. After times in goal. There's a lot of football references here. Whiskey chaser and a penetrating look. X-ray, that's referring to the international radio alphabet. And after W, which is uh, has the code word whiskey, you get X-ray. So X-ray is chasing whiskey. That gives us another X. Seven, oh, this is the play regularly after times in goal increase. Hmm. Not sure. 15 across. During sex, an adult person from Porlock interrupted its description. What on earth is... An adult person from Porlock? What? Oh dear. Um, I have no idea what that's referring to. 14 down. Crossing lines... In nearly new American network, crossed lines, I should say, crossed lines. In nearly new, nearly new is probably most of the word new. Oh, is this Nexus then? That might be a network. Nearly new, N-E, American, U-S, crossed lines. The letter X is made up of a pair of crossed lines and a network is a Nexus. Gives us X in the middle of the grid. Uns oh, look, look at... Ah, have we got X's going down this diagonal? Now, on X... Yes, we do. Look at this. I'm ten I've am spotted this, so I'm going to go with it. I think it's going to be very helpful to the solve. And in fact, the letter X's are in the shape 
of an X in the grid, which is very cool. Right, so this is obviously coexisting then, coexistent. Living together, coexistent. That sounds good, doesn't it? So let's put that in. I can see that's got an anagram of uh, tents at the end of it. Uh, or coexist nearly anyway. Oh, no, it's an anagram of 16 and then T for tense. Ah, oh, good grief. But it is coexistent. So this one, unknown player first. So it's the name of a player. Produced by Ramsey? Ramsey McDonald? Ramsey McDonald? Or was it Ramsey McDonald? Alf Ramsey? Unplayer first. A player is a could be anything. Could be a musical instrument that you play, like a saxophone, sax S A double X produced by Ramsey. A player is a man, is it Manx? That's some sort of reference to the Isle of Man. That does ring the vaguest of bells. Can't think why, but I quite like Manx there. Now this has got an X in it. Learn scripts in appropriate surroundings. I don't know. State vote held in Assam and Darjeeling. Well, Texas then. Assam and Darjeeling are regions of India, but they're also T's. So, um... We've got X for, for a vote. Uh, that's what you might put on a vote, voting slip in the middle there. An amount of poison. It's going to be something like a tox, toxin full or something. Um, that's our robotic voice. This one is play regularly after times in goal. So we need a word for goal to go around that. So that may be expand is an increase. Yes, I've got OK, and I understand that. So you're a goal, if you have an end, you have a goal. And inside that we put um, time, well, times, which is X. That's what you might use to uh, display a multiplication sum. And play regularly is regular letters in the word play, which are the odd letters in this case. The P and the A are in the odd positions, and that gives us expand. So this might be Xanadu now. During sex. Oh, it is Xanadu. It's hidden. It's a hidden you can see it hidden in sex and adult and a person from Porlock interrupted its description. I don't quite know what that's getting at, but it's Xanadu, I'm pretty sure. Um, book that's brutal, no less. Mm, book. Not sure. It's probably a book of the Bible. Ruth, maybe. Let's have a look at that one. Using hands, man goes for it to show how babies are made. Hmm. Sexually? Ah, yes, it is that. If you're using your hands, if something was using hands, it would be manually. So, man goes, remove man from manually and is replaced by it. And it is a euphemism for sex. If you do it, you have sex. So it's sexually there. That's how babies are made. It gives us an X at the start of this one. Woody's laughing face accepting oily mixture. Oh, a laughing face in emojis would be an X and a... Xyl... Oh, I don't know. I think this is something to do with, like, the emojis. You might have an X and a bracket to indicate a smiley face. I'm not sure what this letter's going to be, though. Uh, agree to accept. Leave with difficulty. <sighs> agree to accept. No. Oh, film series in ten pieces. X-Men? Yes, X men. There would be X is the Roman numeral for ten. Pieces are men. X men is a film. Reserve short test to go over mountaineering equipment. 
Oh, ice axe is a presumably the answer there. I don't know why yet. Reserve is ice. A short test. Oh, it's exam reversed. It's a, it goes over, but it's shortened, so it doesn't have the final M, and that gives us mountaineering equipment. Ice axe. Allow former partner. So this does look like it's got let X in the middle, doesn't it? Allow former partner to engage in offensive old way of spreading teletext. <laughs> um, so how's that working? It's T-E-T. -E -T. Oh, the Tet Offensive, of course. Very beautiful clue. Goodness me. Maybe I should have got that. This still looks like Ruth. Book that's brutal. No less. Brutal acts. I don't know. Uh, 26 down. Fashion these domed shelters upside down. Ah, look. Yeah, mode is... Uh, it appears reversed in the letters of these domed. So these domed shelters... The word mode if it's upside down very nicely worded clue quite misleading um but that might help with 25 oh agree to accept leave is that brexit in the middle of that leave is suspicious the way that's in inverted commas agree so agree would have to be four letters with an M in the third position with difficulty. Complexity. Oh, leave is exit then. Comply. It's not Brexit at all. It was um, a clever misdirection. Uh, but it's complexity. We've got comply going around exit. So agree goes round exit and with difficulty, a uh, difficulty is a complexity. So this, I'm sure this begins with Xi, X, Y. Oily mixture. So the oily mixture would have to be an anagram of oily, which would put the O here. Oh, D is probably a smiling face, isn't it? That X and D, if you type them, they would look like a smiley face if the D was capitalized. So xyloid must be woody. Something is xyloid. Not a word I knew. Um, so an amount of poison, that's going to have to begin tox, isn't it? A tox. Directed a team, Guardiola's team. No, Guardiola's team, a city. What's that O doing there? Did that, where did that come from? Toxicity, maybe. Directed at two, team, XI, and 11... The Roman numeral for 11 is XI, so toxicity is the answer there. So passed by, passed could be excreted, couldn't it? That would fit with these letters. <laughs> Holiday makers island is Crete, it is excreted. <laughs> uh, going into east, uh, so by is X, as in if you were to write 3 by 4, you might put 3x4 as a way of extuting that. So by Crete in ED for east, and then um, you might see D on a German number plate to indicate Germany. Um, right, so large, oh, this is our large plane. Oh, this is going to be the name of an airport in California, is it? Large plane, happy to a circle large plane not sure oh this is the line of dots I'm really getting I'm struggling here so this is something box a source of protein for example e.g. egg box oh it is egg box because it's GB for British and I guess in an egg, egg box, you normally get several eggs and they would be a source of protein. So large plane, happy to circle, Californian airport, large plane, galaxy or something. Happy, gay would be 
LAX. LAX is uh, Los Angeles, isn't it? So it is la a large plane. Must be a galaxy. Is that a plane as in something you'd see on a surface rather than a jet plane? Or is there a jet plane called a galaxy? I'm not sure, but it's definitely galaxy. A line of little dots on the radio. Flex. You flex F-L-E-C-K-S. You get flex of colour or something like that. So this is a homophone on the radio is saying it's we would we might hear the word flex f l e c k s uh, and therefore as flex the way we could spell that would be f l e x which is a line right so we are slowly getting towards a solution ah oh, this is our name of our fury ah apoplexy would be a fury wouldn't it apoplexy would fit okay so what a pop uh, loves apple tree with O for a love score in tennis um, in the middle of apple and axes it was axes rather than axes in fury axes are the X and Y axes apoplexy is fury beautiful not easy <laughs> learn scripts contexts or something like that in appropriate surroundings Con, yeah. If you learn, an old word for to learn is to con. Scripts would be texts. And then put that together, contexts, contexts are appropriate surroundings. So contexts is correct there. Now, oh, robotic voice. Alexandria might fit. I don't know why it's that yet, but let's put it in and see why. Nadir anagrammed. I can see that. A robotic voice. Alexa. <laughs> oh, Alexa's here. I can't connect to the Wi-Fi network. She can't connect to the Wi-Fi network, but she wants to get in on solving the crossword. <laughs> That's very funny. So Alexandria um, is the answer. African city. And then, oh, it does look like Ruth then. I don't know what will happen if I type Ruth in and it's right or wrong, but I won't put the H in until I've sort of understood it. Um, ruthless. Okay, ruthless is brutal, no less. So put the H in. Will it let me put the H in? Yes. There we go. So I've solved the puzzle, did it without help, spotted the uh, theme, which is these X's. And as usual, May Maze produces a really, really gorgeous cryptic crossword. So I hope you enjoyed <laughs> watching me go th through that. Some very, very lovely clues. I was particularly pleased with the one about Alexa and we'll see you soon on Cracking the Cryptic.